For the past dozen years, Irvin Magic Johnson has been the heart and soul of the L.A. Lakers. On Thursday, he delivered some heartbreaking news to basketball fans around the world. Because of the, the HIV virus that I have attained, uh, I will have to retire from the Lakers uh, today. Johnson had missed the first three Lakers games this season with what were being called flu symptoms. On Monday, he was given the go-ahead to return to practice, but complained of dehydration and loss of stamina. On Wednesday, he says, he got word of the positive HIV test results. Irvin Johnson has been infected with the HIV virus. He does not have AIDS. The HIV virus is something that over years can and does impair an individual's immune system, which is what we all have to defend against other illnesses. So there is no immediate effect on his life other than we have advised him to avoid those activities which can further impair his immune system, which is playing professional basketball. For the key is that's why I am going to be a spokesman for this HIV virus because I want them to understand that uh, safe sex is the way to go. I think sometimes we think, well, only gay people can get it, only uh, well, it's not going to happen to me, and here I am saying that it can happen to anybody. Johnson is facing his new challenge with the same sort of determination he showed throughout his career. And he's all ready to push ahead with the same positive attitude. You know, what you have to do is just, this another challenge, another chapter in my life that it's like being, your, your back is against the wall. And I think that you just have to come out swinging, and I'm swinging. Uh, you know, the only thing I can do is have a bright side. If I slip, then it might be over. If I'm down, if it's out, you know, I can't be like that. I never have been. That's why I'm telling you now. The shocking loss of Irvin Johnson will be felt first and foremost here at the Great Western Forum, the home of the Lakers. The Magic's absence will in many ways change the NBA to a degree because on the court he was so much more than just a basketball player. Really, I think what this means to the NBA is that another one of our uh, really idols uh, uh, and attention getters has uh, uh, has indicated that uh, he's human something has happened to him which can happen to anybody the tears have rolled and all that and the sympathy that we poured out to each other um, that's gonna always be there and I'm just looking uh, now for him to be on the sideline with me you know we can do what we can from the sideline to help the Laker franchise keep rolling now you just have me on a different side now uh, you may be interviewing me in, in like Dr. Buss's office, so as soon as he move out, I'm going to move in. But uh, I am going to go on, I'm going to beat it, and I'm going to have fun. In Los Angeles, I'm Michael Kalman, CNN Sports.